In this example, we have a system of simultaneous linear equations, and we have to show that this system is consistent independent. In other words, the corresponding coefficients of x and y and the constant terms form unequal fractions. The coefficients of x are 5 and 1. The coefficients of y are negative 2 and 1, and the constant terms are negative 10 and negative 9. Now, the first fraction becomes equal to 5, the second fraction becomes equal to negative 2, and the third fraction is equal to 10 over 9. It is obvious that the three fractions are not equal, so this condition is true, which means that the system is consistent independent. Now, let's plot these two equations on a graph and see what they look like. So, I'm going to start with the first equation, and I'm going to calculate the y-intercept. So let x equal 0, which means 5x equals 0, so the equation becomes minus 2y minus 10 equals 0. If we solve this for y, we end up with y equals negative 5. We plot this point on the graph and we label it. Next, we calculate the, the x-intercept by letting y equal 0, so negative 2y equals 0. So the equation becomes 5x minus 10 equals 0. We solve for x, and x equals 2, so the x-intercept of this line is 2 and 0. We draw the line and we label it. Then, we do the same thing for the second equation. Uh, we calculate the y-intercept, we let x equal 0, so the equation becomes y minus 9 equals 0, so the y-coordinate is y equals 9. We plot this point on the graph, the intercept has coordinates 0 and 9. And then we do the x-intercept by letting y equals 0, so we end up with x minus 9 equals 0, so the x-intercept is 9 and 0. We draw the line and we plot, we label the graph. Notice how the point of intersection is 4 and 5, so consistent independent systems have one point of intersection, one unique solution.